Amen. Praise the Lord. New Rises Church family and friends. This is Pastor Wiggins, and I greet you in the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, who is alive and not dead. And because of that, you and I ought to be rejoicing. And again, I say rejoice. Amen. Praise the Lord today for you being a part of this prayer series, this daily devotional as we're praying through the scriptures. And we're praying about the names of God and the titles of God that have been revealed to us in the scriptures. And this is day number six. And we're going to be reading from Isaiah chapter 53 and verse 1 from the New King James Version of the Word of God. Here's what the Word of God says. Verse 1, Isaiah 53. Who has believed our report? And to whom has the arm of the Lord been revealed? Amen. Who has believed our report? And to whom has the arm of the Lord been revealed? Amen. We want to pray for two things today. Number one. We want to pray that God would show himself strong in our lives. That's right. We want to pray that God would show himself strong in our lives. And then secondly, we want to pray that we would share our testimony about the Lord's strength in our lives. We want to pray that as God shows himself strong in our life, we'll share our testimony about the Lord's strength in our life. Come on, let's pray. Father, in Jesus' name, we thank you and bless you and praise you for this day. We thank you for this prayer opportunity, Lord, as we read your word and we understand your name and your title so that we may know who you are and what you're capable and willing to do in our lives. Lord, we know in Ephesians chapter 3, verse 20, that you're able to do exceedingly and abundantly above all we can ask, think, or imagine. Thank you, Lord, for setting the bar that we can ask you for whatever we need, and you will do exceedingly more than that. Thank you for revealing yourself in Scripture here in Isaiah 53 and verse 1. For the prophet said that that you are a strong God. You are a God of supernatural strength. And you said, O God, in your word, who has believed our report? And to whom has the arm of the Lord been revealed? Lord, our testimony is your strength has been revealed in our lives. Lord, we all have testimonies that when we were at our lowest, God, that's when you came in and with your strong arm raised us up. God, there are many can testify that when we were at our weakness, that's when you, in fact, were strong in our lives. God, we've experienced the arm of you. We've experienced the strength of your right hand coming in right when we needed you, right when we were getting ready to give up, quit, and throw in the towel. You showed yourself strong in our life and in our situation. Right when the enemy had us cornered, Lord, you showed up time and time and time and time and time again, and you showed yourself strong. And so today, God, we pray you would do that again. Lord, in somebody's life that is under the sound of my voice, God, they feel weak, They feel that they're at the end of their rope. They don't know what to do. Everything is caving in on them. Their backs are up against the wall. They don't know if they can make it yet another day. But yet, God, you've led them to this prayer. You've led them to this devotional. You've led them to this opportunity to hear that you are a strong tower, that you have a strong arm of deliverance that you are strong when they are weak. And I pray you would show yourself strong in their life today. Lord, even in this prayer time, even in this time of meditation to you, I pray that their inner person would be renewed day by day. I pray that when they come out of this prayer time, Lord God, that their spirit person would be strong and they would stand in the power of your might and face whatever the enemy has, knowing that you, God, are on the inside. And you, when you are with us, God, you are more than the world against us. Lord, I pray you would show yourself strong today in the lives of our children that are in school. Lord, the weakest among us, the most vulnerable among us, God, show yourself strong in their lives, in the lives of our grandparents and great grandparents, our senior saints, Lord God, in their their weakness and their flesh, God, give them strength in their spirit in Jesus' name. Show yourself strong today. And I pray, Lord God, that as you do it, we too would then share our testimony 
about your strength showing up in our lives. Lord, let us not be ashamed of the gospel. Lord, let us not be ashamed of your good works in our life, knowing it is the power of God unto salvation to everyone that believes. God, let us use our testimonies to strengthen somebody else's life. Lord, if you've encouraged us and strengthened us, let us be an encouragement and a strength to somebody else by sharing the good news of what you've done in our life. Lord, let us use technology and phones and iPads and computers to share our testimony. Lord, put us in front of people face to face that we might be able to share our testimony. Lord, let us walk in a way, God, that someone would ask about the reason for our hope, about the reason for our confidence, about the reason for our strength in the face of adversity. And Lord God, I pray today that as you do that and you give testimony to us, that others would hear about your good news and trust in the strong arm of the Lord to deliver them out of whatever situation they may be in. And Lord, I believe victory in the lives of your people. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Listen, I love you in the Lord today. Our scripture came from Isaiah. That's right, Isaiah 53 and 1. Who has believed our report and to whom has the arm of the Lord been revealed? Listen, I love you in the Lord. I'm looking forward to God. Uh, Let me pray with you and pray for you tomorrow. We'll be back. Be victorious. God bless.